It's the love for ballroom that rescues the abandoned. It's the love that supports those in the darkest times. Love is the message today. Are y'all ready for the good stuff? Then we get to work. The canvas is clean, beautiful, perfect. Now let's get to the fun part. Creating magic all over your face. And face is something that the mother knows a little something about. So why don't we get down to it? So today, the face has been brought to you by none other. Bridgerton! The Duke is waiting on us to get ready for the ball. So we're getting ready for the ball. Today, we're going to do something special. With, I'm going to show you how to get ready for the ball using Pat's Complete. Bridgerton collection. Now, what I'm not going to do on my channel, I'm going to do something different than other people do, and I'm not going to do what everybody else do. And the reason why I'm not going to waste my time um, doing something that and is redundant on everybody's channel, because I think that's what a lot of people do, I'm going to, and I don't want to also do something that I'm personally not interested in. So I'm going to tell you now at the start on this channel, I'm not going to, nine times out of 10, I'm not going to get all into detail about social makeup, where it was manufactured at, because I can care less. It, it's, I understand that it does and it's debatable and stuff. I just don't care. All I really care about as a consumer, if the product is good or not. If that's what you want to know, that's fine. I'm not going to waste my time. Um, I'm not going to waste my time on how many grams and all those things. And you want to know why. And to be very honest, I don't care. You know why I don't care? Because let me tell y'all something. You're going to buy it anyway. I think y'all care too much about frivolous information and try to talk about something when somebody give you a little bit more and a little bit less. For no reason, because you're still going to support and buy it anyway. If you don't, don't do it. And and, and I have watched a few people's. Um, I've been watching for weeks now because I needed to do my research on this whole YouTube thing. And I noticed what a lot of people do is they try, especially now since COVID has been going on and prices have been going up and things have been changing. Nobody has taken into account that since Christmas, that's why everything was so gravy Christmas. After January the 1st, y'all didn't realize that all prices for all merchandise, all merchants went up. It was a price increase January the 1st on everything. Nothing will stay the same. Nothing complacent in America, especially that we have this notion that we are entitled. We're not entitled. We're we, we're so entitled that we forget that it's a privilege. And we better be thankful. You don't have to spend your money. You don't have to spend it. So if you don't spend it, then they will change. If you want to spend it, more power to you. Let's get right down to it. So it's a trio. Two blushes and a highlighter. And I got this because I don't have, I have the two blushes but I don't have the bronzer. I mean highlighter. <laughs> I wish she would make a bronzer ASAP. It makes packing a little lighter. Y'all ready to paint this mug? You ready to paint this mug? Yes, let's get down to it. We're going to start out. We're going to blend. We're going to blend. One thing about Pat blushes, if you read in or saw any videos or know anything about it, it is buildable. Use this NARS blush. Because I did it on that side, I don't have to do it on this side. Just to, because this NARS brush is 
light so it's not going to deposit a lot of color. See that? Almost kind of like somebody pinched my cheeks. Perfect. Oh, a little blush. I want to do something different. Something that I have not seen on anybody's channel and what made me want to do this. Because my girlfriend, I gave her a pat palette for Christmas. And she went to a party and she stated that she don't know if she like it because the pigment isn't, it doesn't have a lot of pigment. And I had to explain to her that she didn't know how to use the palette. <laughs> now you could have got the wand and she was like, why you didn't give me the wand? Why you didn't tell me? You could have got the Intensify wand, which is now back in stock. Mm. And, or you can use water. And so I had to show her, I'm going to swatch it wet and dry for you guys. I decided to speed this up, guys, so that you guys can see exactly what I'm doing. So I'm placing the blushes down wet and dry. So I hopefully you can see and you can try it for yourself how easy it is to transform these products to something new and different. And don't just only think that you could just use these products for blushes. You could use them for eyeshadow. You could use them for lipstick, lip sting, anything that you may choose to want to see fit. Always use your imagination with makeup and create anything Do you see possible. That? Do you see that's wet, dry, wet, dry, wet, dry. I'm going to speed through this highlighter portion. As you can see, the blinding effect that this highlighter gives. Just a nice, subtle glow. Psych! Nothing is subtle about that glow. And there you go. The blush and highlighter trio palette from the Bridgerton Collection from Pat McGrath Labs. And next we have the highlighting duos. So this collection ended up having three highlighters. One in the trio kit and then two standalones. These are the Sublime Skin Highlighters and the, what is this? This is the Extreme and this is incandescent gold. Both of them are gold, zero, zero, two. So I tried it earlier and I know exactly how I want to put them on because they are beautiful. This is beautiful. And I'm going to show you how I did it earlier. Um, it just was fabulous. You see that? Put that yellow down. That extreme yellow gold. And I'm not a yellow type of girl. I'm more of a pink. Pink, pearl type of situation. I really don't even like gold. I don't like gold jewelry. Let me turn the light out so you can see. You see that? You see that sublime? Oh. 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 Hmm. Yes. The embossing is amazing on it, isn't it? Look at that. You see how, what I mean by swatching these wet and dry? Because it gives you two different looks so people can see and people can understand. This wet looks totally different than this dry. This will be, this can be your eyeshadow. This could be your center. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Even that, wet, it's beautiful. It's dry by itself, gorgeous. Don't get me wrong. But wet, wet, wet. What woman doesn't like being wet? <laughs> I know, ain't no man complaining. Wet. I know I like it. It's just sublime. Pat. Love it. And that is the highlighting. And I have to say, 
Let's talk about it. Just like everybody's saying. This print, not embossing. This is sheet. This embossing should have been raised and it would have been great, but I understand it probably was a last minute thing. Um, it is what it is, but the compact, the compact is better than the paper. So I'm not complaining, Pat. Thank you. Now, I wish that you would do everything in these compacts. And people will be complaining all the time, but you also do things like this so that the price point can be down for other people to enjoy. I personally, everything ain't for everybody to enjoy. Save your money and be able to enjoy it. Um, I personally love the hard shell palettes. And I would, Pat, listen to me, Pat. This, make a blush like this. Make a highlighter like this. Wonderful. This will be so beautiful. Do you know how sickening this will be? Just with highlighters or blushes. Or make a pro one where all your blushes are in this whole little thing so it opens up and it's just so beautiful. And you can just dab, 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 dab. Everything. But hey, who am I? Little old me. The Bridgerton's eyeshadow palette. Yay! Bridgerton's. I think everybody, I fell in love with this. I was literally, when it dropped, I was watching it. I was mesmerized. I could not stop watching. I binge watched every episode. I cried. I fell in love. I instantly, I instantly hit up the Duke instantly. And I told him that he will be the next leading African-American superstar. Don't mind the palette because I already <laughs> swatched the little things in it. <laughs> Don't mind it. Don't mind it. There's the swatches. So dry, wet, dry, wet, dry, wet, dry, wet. Dry, wet, dry, wet. Do you see how you changed it with the dry versus the wet? Like Duchess as a base. You are not logged into Amazon. Amazon, if you don't get out of here. Sorry, y'all. That's my light switches talking to me. Ooh, that's intense. That look like somebody's chrome car. Let's turn this light out so you can see. This color is so soft and beautiful. It can be worn from day to night. Next, we're going to use that beautiful plum and create that cut crease so it can accentuate that beautiful, beautiful chrome color. Voila, is the magic of the internet. Let's add some blue. Y'all wanna play in the blue? You want to play in the blue. I want to play in the blue. With the flick of the wand, I'm ready for the ball. So, a couple of years ago for New York Fashion Week, Pat had the Mothership Ball. And she used my um, video from a moment I did in the ball. You might scene. have noticed that video As at the her, beginning of this video. Main that is exactly what she video. posted and made. And it was such an honor. So I was invited to come walk her ball for face. And you had the head judge, which was Naomi Campbell. You had Cardi B, Tiana Taylor. Um, you had so many other celebrities on the panel. You had Pamela Anderson in the building, Lori Harvey. Um, just so many people in the building. Oh my God. And... I walked and I won the grand prize. Yes. Naomi Campbell deemed me the face of the night. And so the category was to bring it, bring to life one of Pat's iconic fashion show makeup looks. And I chose the Dolce and Gabbana runway collection. It was so beautiful. And because Pat helped design 
um, help do the Doja and Gabbana makeup line. Um, and so I wanted to pay homage with a beautiful canvas and face and the look and everything. And it was such, such a beautiful moment to have. And that's like my, my biggest, that's the all time favorite and biggest ballroom moment is having Naomi Campbell deem me the face and the winner. Oh. Amount of money can be given to me that can ever change that moment because nobody else will ever have it. That's the beautiful part. So, um, and also to receive a text message of Naomi saying that I was just pure perfection, was everything. <laughs> Thank you, Naomi, twin. Um, so yeah. Pat, everybody was so lovely. So, hey, thanks, Pat. So let me teach you how to sell face. Face consists of the eyes, the nose, the skin, it's the structure. Give it to me, sell it to me, work that camera, darling. Sell that Carter. That mug is sitting like that. Off to the ball. <laughs> Oh my God, you sound like Sanaya. Why are you in the Sanaya? Don't know where you flow. First, you gotta just let go. To get where you're going, it's not about knowing. It's about the journey. It's about the journey. It's all about the journey. It's all about the journey. Girl tested, but mother approved. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.